I don't know if you know this, there's a lot of people here on A1A. This is the most amazing event. Fort Lauderdale has never seen a parade this popular. This is unbelievable. Yeah, Dean, I, we all, on, on behalf of everybody at It's Happening Out, we congratulate you because this is really wow, this an is amazing. The community. Straight, gay, lesbian, transgender, the entire city has come out here. There are tens of thousands of people out here today, and Fort Lauderdale has never, ever, ever seen something like this. And it's all because of the community, because of talented people like Carlos, because of all of you who are part of this community. People were just waiting for this opportunity to come out and, and express their feelings towards one another. And look at what we have here today. It's amazing. We, we, were, we, uh, we, uh, we opened our show talking with Richard Gray, and we were talking about Pride of America and how unique Broward County, but specifically Fort Lauderdale, is. Uh, where else in the world, really, can you have um, a Wilton Manors of a city commission that's all gay and a mayor? We have an openly gay mayor in Fort Lauderdale, but what strikes me even more, first time ever that we've had a parade in Broward County on historic A1A, and the mayor is the Grand Marshal, and the mayor shows up in the gayest badge of mayor I have ever seen in my life. <laughs> I tried. <laughs> what is this moment like for you, being mayor and having something historic like well, this? Well, I have to tell you, uh, this makes me feel so good as the mayor, you know, gay or otherwise, the fact that a community can, can, can come out and show their support for one another and to, and to have all the high school bands come out here and to have uh, people from people who are staying in their hotels waving to me from their hotel rooms. Um, and look at look what's coming up here now. This is amazing. It's Blockfest um, I mean, is amazing yes, every year. It's amazing. So this is not about just the LGBT community. This is about the entire city coming yeah, out exactly. and showing their support and yeah. love for one another. Yeah. yeah. Well, Dean, one of the things that was interesting to me, Richard uh, was explaining to me that the county in general is, is unique in being a majority minority county. Latino, black, gay, right, right, women, etc. Right, that is correct. Why, why so much diversity here? Why, how has this community survived its embracement of such dramatic because diversity? Because we build roads, we build bridges, we don't build walls. Yes! Yes! We, we embrace people from all cultures. This morning was the, was the historic uh, Sistrunk Parade and, and festival. I was there this morning greeting the African American community as they celebrate uh, Black History Month, which is the month of February. And here we have this evening the LGBT gay uh, uh, parade that, I'm telling you, the Pride Parade has been like, I've been through many Pride Parades here in Fort Lauderdale over the years. This is 10 times what we've ever seen in the past. Yeah. Dean, I, uh, we, we thank you so much. We know how busy you are in this event. But uh, before we let you get away, I've got to ask you about Pride of America, Fort Lauderdale, April 2020. Next year, next year, we've invited all the countries in the Western Hemisphere, South America, Central America, the Caribbean, Canada to all participate in this parade on this site and to celebrate who we are as Americans north south central everywhere awesome so we invite awesome. you all to be here I, I feel like I, on, I, I feel like you and I are best friends now I, I see him almost every night on on behalf of well, everybody this has been the most amazing pride weekend I've ever seen anywhere in the country between the fashion show thank you very much between the the the, uh, the Stonewall banquet we had last night and the uh, the uh, drag brunch and the brunch today was unbelievable. Awesome! Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I've never seen a more beautiful brunch. I and then the festival tomorrow is going to be an amazing, amazing. I weekend. have to remind everybody uh, around uh, the United States and outside of America. Uh, Stonewall celebration is June 30 at World Pride, but the National Stonewall Museum exists right here in Fort Lauderdale. So make sure you come to Fort Lauderdale for the National Stonewall Museum. Uh, Dean, thank you thank very you so much. much for having thank me. Thank, thank you. you. Great. Happy Pride. Yes, to you. Thank, thank you, sir. Thank you. Congratulations.